guys, so today is Saturday and I have just come back from a photo shoot. So the photo shoot was done at Strally Castle and we spent like an hour and a half there and basically it was based on um, a photographer Wendy Riggins' work. I won't have edited any at this point because I'm going to buy Photoshop tomorrow so that I can take my Mac into school and do the editing on that because I shot them all in RAW. I do photography A level and we have to make a final piece so our theme is mystery imagination and for that I've gone uh, Disney princesses because it's very imaginative and I feel like children are the most imaginative people like ever so that's why I've decided to do this. I'm going to talk about props I used so we had we had five princesses I think I'm not sure whether one of them is going to make it into the final ones so we started off doing Belle from Beauty and the Beast and we did Cinderella because Strally Castle has this staircase that is just like jaw dropping, it's amazing. We did Rapunzel, but we also used Rapunzel's dress as an attempt to do Aurora because they didn't have an Aurora dress, but that's what I'm not too sure about. Also, we did Snow White and Elsa, and I think there's some really nice ones of her. Uh, dress up as Elsa, which is her favourite princess, I believe. Um, but I don't think I'm going to use them for my trophy, but I might get one printed out big so that it's like nice. I use an apple for Snow White, and we tried to get a picture where she was holding the apple and then the apple mid fall, but it was really hard to get that. So that's really gutting. Um, just use these shoes. Open them. They just look like this. And I just use that as uh, the glass slipper because we couldn't find any glass slippers. But can you see that? I hope so. Um. So you may know this book if you are a Once Upon a Time, Once Upon a Time fan. Um, and this is just a scrapbook, so there's not actually anything in here. And it comes with this storybook, story book, um, postcard. And I've got a couple of clips from <coughs> the shoot, which are going to be used in like three different videos. Now they're going to be in my PMS. February they're going to be in a day in the life video on breathe easy because that is a theme in like two weeks time I think so check out that and also this video say thank you to Ella who was my little model and her mother and grandmother because they were the ones who brought her and they were the ones who ran round Strally Castle trying to get her to perk up because at the start of the shoot she was really like I don't want to do it like she just woke up and she's like three I think so she was really hmm. but then once we done Cinderella she'd sort of like oh this is good this is fun hopefully they would be happy with me posting the photos 
on like Facebook, Twitter, Instagram and here. So if you guys want to go see them, you can find the link in the description box to my Facebook page. Um, and I will post all the photos up there when I get a chance after I've edited them. And it was really fun to go to Shroddy Castle and shoot for a couple of hours. And I really enjoyed. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe because that is the nice thing to do. And I'll see you guys next Monday at 6. Bye. Monthly vlog. So I had this idea from a few YouTubers that I watch. And I'll start with Sammy Paul because he is the one who created PMS and then other people have taken it and made it their own as well. So you've got uh, Jack Howard who also did PMS but he only did it for three months, not 12. Um, Hazel Hayes does Time of 